The Good Half. Now, The Good Half is a brand new film starring Nicholas. Nicholas, sorry. Nick Jonas. Nick Jonas, Brittany Snow, Matt Walsh, uh, Elizabeth Shue, and David Arquette. This is all about an emotionally distant writer returns to his hometown of Cleveland for his beloved mother's funeral after spending his years successfully avoiding interactions with his high-strung sister, bumbling but well-meaning father, and untrustworthy stepfather. While in town, he forges a new relationship with a charming, eccentric, eccentric, energetic stranger who pushes him to realize that he can't avoid conflict forever with his family or within himself. This is a good little script, emotionally emotionally written. Nick Jonas is fantastic, as is Brittany Snow. These performances are great. I think that you should definitely check this film out. Um, David Arquette isn't in it a lot. It's more about uh, the, the siblings more than anything because they're grieving together. I think they do a great job of building that relationship as brother and sister. Fantastic chemistry between our two uh our two leads here, fantastic storytelling. I like the costumes here as well. Good score. We do get a little bit of Nick Jonas singing in there. We can't have a film in there without him singing, I guess. I don't think it was needed, but I think that uh, I think that The Good Have is a good little film. It does come out on digital today. Check it out if you're interested. I'm going to give The Good Half uh, three out of five stars. So next up is going, uh, uh, sorry. So next up, I have a review, a review for two Hallmark films. Check out those uh, next. But let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Did you get to see? Did you get to see the good half when it premiered in August? In August, as part of the Fathom events, I got a screener for it. I didn't get to see it in a theater at a Fathom event, unfortunately. But let me know your thoughts in the comments down below, and let me know your thoughts.